You're listening to Bulletproof Audio Articles, the best way to lose weight according to science. If you've ever tried to lose weight, then you know that the dieting advice out there can be overwhelming and often conflicting. Do a five-day juice fast. Eat only meat. Go ultra low fat. The problem is many diets aren't backed by good science and you're left feeling hungry, irritable, and unsatisfied. Even if you do lose weight, sticking to such extremes is not sustainable and you end up right where you started or worse, heavier than before. But it turns out there are healthy ways to lose weight and keep it off. Methods backed by solid research. In this article, we'll discuss the best science-backed diet tips to losing weight. How to lose weight fast. Sometimes you just wanna fit into those skinny jeans and you want to do it now. That's where the Bulletproof Rapid Fat Loss Protocol comes in. It helps you lose weight and fast. You only wanna try this method if you're significantly overweight or obese and you have healthy functioning kidneys and liver. Otherwise, following the Bulletproof Diet combined with intermittent fasting is a safer and more sustainable solution for weight loss. The Bulletproof Rapid Fat Loss Protocol puts you into ketosis when your body burns fat for energy. That's for six days, followed by one day of carbo loading combined with supplements to help your body get rid of toxins released from your fat. If this sounds like the best weight loss plan for you, you can learn more at blog.bulletproof.com. How to lose weight and burn fat, a more sustainable approach. While Rapid Fat Loss Protocol is great if you're looking to lose weight very quickly, it's a better idea to find a sustainable eating plan that you can easily follow in the long term. Follow these five weight loss tips to help you reach your body goals. One, choose a high fat, low carbohydrate diet. If you've ever gone on a diet, it's probably been some version of the decades old low fat, high carb regimen. You probably know that the diet didn't work. It left you with sugar spikes, energy crashes, cravings, and ultimately no weight loss. New research is debunking earlier claims that fat is bad. It might sound counterintuitive, but you actually need fat to keep the fat off. There's science to it. When you load up on the right kinds of fat and limit carbs, you force your body to burn fat rather than glucose, aka sugar, for fuel. This puts you into ketosis. That's when your liver converts fatty acids into molecules called ketones to use as energy. That's why the trendy high-fat, low-carb keto diet is so popular. It turns your body into a fat-burning machine. Ketones suppress ghrelin, that's your hunger hormone, and increase CCK, the hormone that keeps you feeling full. You naturally end up eating less as a result. When you're not hungry, it's easier to go for longer periods without food. And this forces your body to tap its fat stores for energy. Eating fat gives you another metabolic advantage. It doesn't trigger the release of insulin the way glucose does. Insulin tells your cells to store fat. And the more insulin your body produces, the more fat that gets stored. So how do you lose weight on keto? On a keto diet, you wanna eat mostly fats, about 75% of your daily calories, some protein, about 20%, and a very small amount of carbs, less than 5%. Keto diets like the Bulletproof diet focus on grass-fed meat and butter, wild fish, organic vegetables, and healthy fats like avocado and coconut oil. That way, you stay healthy while you lose weight. Eating unhealthy fats, such as on a dirty keto or Atkins diet, actually ramps up inflammation, and that makes weight loss much more difficult. Two, choose a cyclical keto diet. Restricting carbs for a long time can cause problems in some people, like thyroid issues, fatigue, dry eyes, and insomnia. Your body needs some carbs to perform at its best. That's why Bulletproof recommends a cyclical keto diet when you go in and out of ketosis on a weekly basis. On cyclical keto, aka carb cycling, you eat more carbs on one day of the week, roughly 150 grams of carbs. But on the other six days of the week, you follow the standard keto diet and eat less than 50 grams of net carbs a day. Here are some benefits of carb cycling. It keeps you slender, satisfies carb cravings, creates a stronger immunity, gives you better sleep, and balances your gut bacteria. So go ahead and eat clean carbs like sweet potatoes, squash, and white rice one day a week. Doing this will keep your body systems that need some amount of carbs working properly, and it'll keep the weight off in the long haul. Three, don't cut calories. Restricting calories is another outdated recommendation that can actually cause you to put on weight. When you cut calories, you signal to your body 
body that food is scarce. This puts you into famine mode. Your metabolism slows down to preserve the calories you're taking in, and this slower metabolism can remain even after you've stopped restricting calories. Eating fewer calories can also cause tiredness, irritability, nutrient deficiencies, constipation, short attention span, hunger and cravings, headaches, and anxiety. Cutting calories can be especially hard on women. As a woman, you evolve to remain fertile and to reproduce, but when you restrict calories and healthy fats, your body thinks that there isn't enough food to make a baby. Your fertility will stop until you get more calories in to support reproduction. So how do you lose weight without restricting calories? You fast. Science shows you can lose a lot of weight with intermittent fasting. Which brings us to tip number four. Try intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting simply means you eat all the food you need during a shorter window of time. There are various methods, but the most common involves eating over a six to eight hour window and fasting for the remaining 14 to 16 hours. With bulletproof intermittent fasting, you skip breakfast and replace it with buttery bulletproof coffee to keep hunger levels in check. Fasting for short periods of time is actually the natural state for your body to be in. Your ancestors evolved in situations where food was scarce and their bodies learned to thrive while fasting. Intermittent fasting carries all kinds of mental and physical benefits, including accelerating weight loss. Fasting gets you into ketosis quicker. It drains your glucose reserves, forcing your body to reach into its fat stores for energy. In one study, mice who ate within a 9 to 12 hour period put on less weight and had lower fat mass than mice who ate at all hours. Another study found that obese people who ate 25% of their daily calories on one day, then ate normally the following day, lost up to 13 pounds over an eight week period. So here's how to intermittent fast. When you're following the bulletproof diet, you skip breakfast and eat lunch and dinner within a six hour window. That gives you an 18 hour fast. Most people can fast every day, although women sometimes need to fast every other day or just a couple times a week. You can learn more about intermittent fasting if you're a woman by visiting blog.bulletproof.com. Experiment to see what works for you. Skipping breakfast isn't easy. Distracting hunger pings, anyone? But there's a hack to keeping the hangries at bay. Which brings us to number five. Drink a bulletproof coffee in the morning. Drinking a bulletproof coffee instead of eating breakfast sends a signal to your body that you've eaten or you won't feel hungry. Each cup contains black coffee, grass-fed butter, and brain octane oil, a purified form of saturated fatty acids called MCTs, sourced from 100% coconut oil. By eating fat only, no protein and carbs, you remain in full fat-burning ketosis. The high dose of quality fats keeps you full for hours, so you can power through your morning without dreaming of bagels. Brain Octane also raises your level of ketones, four times more effectively than regular coconut oil. Use Brain Octane in your coffee and drizzle it over your meals. It creates a background level of ketones by keeping ketones up to 0.7 that's millimoles per liter. A blood ketone level of 0.5 is enough to suppress appetite. If you'd like to check out the official Bulletproof Coffee recipe or learn more about science-backed weight loss tips, visit blog.bulletproof.com.